can count on. All is quiet for right now, but if you look out toward the northwest above Seattle and Portland, that's our storm getting its act together coming in around Tuesday, Wednesday. For right now, though, temperatures are in the 60s in the valley, so it's starting to cool off. Right now, we're at 61 in Redding, 57, though, in Red Bluff, 61 in Paradise. Chico, you're at 59, of course, cooler in the mountains, 39 in Alturas, 36 in Susanville, and 32 degrees in Truckee at this time. Here's something I haven't said in a long time, rain in the forecast. First, though, we got to get through Sunday. We'll be sunny and mild for one more day. Monday, cooler with uh, some winds and some clouds. The rain and the snow starts Tuesday and continues through Friday. Your holiday week's going to be quite stormy. Doesn't look like it here, but this storm is just starting to get its act together. So let's pan it out over the next couple of days. For your Sunday, high pressure remains in control for one more day. Look what happens on Monday. Yeah, the jet stream takes a big dip. That's when we're going to cool. Cool off by about 10 degrees. We'll get some clouds and we'll get some windy conditions as well. Look what happens Tuesday. A major winter storm is barreling into California. Looks like the rain will start moving into our region late morning into early afternoon. Once it hits, it brings its cool air with it, and that continues to bring precipitation to our region on Wednesday with snow to very low elevations, and that also continues on your Thanksgiving Day. It's going to be a stormy week across California, so let's take a closer look at what this is going to look like for us in Northern California. For your Sunday, we are in the clear. Temperatures right around the upper 60s to near 70 in the valley for one more day. Then on Monday, the clouds increase. Late in the afternoon, some snow showers start up by Mount Shasta. That, right, by the way, is right at the Mount Shasta Ski Resort, though. Look what happens Monday night into Tuesday morning. All of us get the clouds, some snow starts in the mountains, some rain on the coast. And right here, this particular forecast model is showing snow in the Redding area Tuesday afternoon. I do think this one's a tad overdone, but nevertheless, we're going to have some cold air with this system. Look what brings it in, or what comes in Tuesday night. Snow for most of Northern California, some rain in the valley. Is forecast from Chico South, and once again, this particular model is showing a rain-snow mix from Redding to Chico. I don't think it's going to get quite as far south as Chico, but look for some snow showers around the Redding area, maybe as far south as Red Bluff. By Wednesday morning, we break up a little bit, but the snow continues in the mountains. Wednesday evening, another band comes in, also showing snow in the Redding area with rain in the valley and snow continuing in the mountains. And this continues on Thursday. So let's talk about the snow a little bit more. It's going to be stormy in the mountains. The passes in the ski resorts are going to be measuring snow in feet. The foothills are going to get snow in inches. This is a travel period, so expect travel delays, chain controls, and possible road closures Tuesday through Thursday. It's going to be hectic on the roads. Might want to leave early or postpone your travel if you possibly can. All right, that's a couple days out. Four years Sunday, mostly sunny and mild for one more day. Western mountains, your highs in the upper 50s to lower 60s. Eastern mountains, sunny and mild after a chilly morning. Lows in the 20s, highs in the 50s to near 60 degrees. Foothills tomorrow, mostly sunny. Highs in the 60s. Sterling City a little higher up, your high 59 degrees. In the valley tomorrow, say hello to 70s for one more day. 69 in Corning and in Los Molinos. Mid-Valley, upper 60s tomorrow. We are all going to cool off this week, and we're going to get that precipitation. Right now, it looks like Tuesday through Thursday, and then another storm next weekend. That includes the Redding area, where there is a chance of snow at times, especially the hills around Redding. It's really going to change. And wow. by the way, I want to mention precipitation expected in the valley, about a half inch to an inch at this time. Okay. The 40s? <laughs> The 40s. I, I, I'm From not the 60s to the 40s. I'm not making that up. <laughs> and then Redding could see snow. I, I think they're going to see snow, whether it sticks and whether it hits downtown wow. or not. It's debatable. The hills around it look pretty likely, maybe even south of Redding. It's a cold storm out of the north. So it's a white Thanksgiving. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks so much, Mike. And Brandon joins us now. What are you talking about tonight? You know, in, in fact, what you were just talking about.